What's up you guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be checking out some more of these Garden of Bam Bam 4 animations. So in the last couple of episodes that we watched of these, we met two new Garden of Bam Bam monsters. The first monster was Harry Mary, the big pink jumbo Josh looking creature with the snake hair. And the second monster was Joking Jesse. But after playing a few games with Joking Jesse, Coach Piccolina showed up and captured Joking Jesse, accusing him of attacking her little baby elephant kids but hopefully today we're gonna find out if joking jesse is innocent or guilty and we're also gonna meet a new monster all right guys here we go so this is where we left off last time we're being chased or we are chasing joking jesse because he took our our drone remote that's what he was trying to take from us but we couldn't escape this area until luckily coach piccolina showed up and opened up the door and I also have no idea what Joking Jesse is. Is he a monkey? He kind of looks like Coach Pickles, kind of, like a little bit smaller. But I want to say it's supposed to be just like a Garden of Bam Bam monkey character. It's kind of hard to tell. Guys, let me know in the comments if you know what kind of animal or monster Joking Jesse is supposed to be, because it's very confusing. And that's right, we got to like spray him with water to get him to fall down. Apparently, Joking Jesse hates water. And then this is the final nozzle that we have to spray at him to get our drone remote. Give me that thing back. He is fine. Coach Piccolina shows up, okay. <laughs> She's gonna start like boxing him. Isn't that like what she was trying to do? She was like interrogating him. Yeah, we're going back down to the, the Coach Piccolina gym. She's gonna beat him up a little bit. I feel like he's innocent by the way that he's reacting. Sheriff Toadster. Hey, you. Why did you come here? Did you do it? I can't tell you. Otherwise, I'm dead. It's better to tell me now. Before, Piccolina gets completely angry. Hey, what's happened? Are you kidding me? Get him. Well, now he's, he's gone. He just ran away. Uh, yes, okay. Bruh, he's got to be guilty. Why would he run away when Sheriff Toaster shows up? Somebody flickered the lights off so that he could leave. Now where are we going? Oh, he's playing a game. He wants us to catch us again. <laughs> we can catch you, bro. Oh, we're just slowly walking. Oh, he's got a secret passageway. So wait, when he like had the, the lights turn on and off, it wasn't him that did it. Somebody else turned the lights off so that he could escape. And I think it's going to be the new monster that we're about to see. Woolius Julius. Dude, this is crazy. Where are we going? We just went through like a portal into space. So Woolius Julius, who we will meet in this video, is supposed to be like an orange space fox. That's what he looks like to me. But I didn't really get a good enough look at him. This is crazy. We're doing like a planet obby. Kind of reminds me of the Nibbler's room. If you guys remember Nibbler, it was like a like a dream realm. It was kind of similar to this. Oh, he's howling. So is he a fox or a wolf? He's orange like a fox. Whoa. Dude, is this the mini game we have to do? Julius Julius mission. Put the planets in the correct order and you will receive a gift. I love space so much, but I don't think that I could put the planets in order. Unless the planets are showing the order right in front of me. So maybe we're just supposed to copy what it's showing right there. We got Earth, Saturn, Jupiter, obviously the Sun, Pluto. Yeah, I think we're just supposed to like copy that diagram. Whoa, is that supposed to be the moon? And then do we have to make it shift? 
Kind of looks like we have to make it, like, orbit. Maybe that's how we put it in order. You, you have to, like, move them around a little bit. Oh, yeah, you do. You have to move each one that you put in there. That is so cool, dude. Yo, Buggy Huggy is very creative, guys. Like, this is crazy. I would have never been able to think of something like this. And we got Julius Woolius, the, the space fox. So how many more do we have to do? Like four? I don't know what planet that is. That, that is. What is that, Saturn? <laughs> I can't really tell. Yeah, we only have a few more to do. Wait a second. Is that Saturn? Or is that Jupiter? I have no idea. You guys are probably going to school me on space. Because I'm probably getting all these wrong. This might be the last one. The blue planet. Goes all the way on the side. Wait, no, we have another one? Okay, now that's all the planets, I think. Nice, I heard the ding and then the sun opens up. And that's how we get the key card. Uh-oh, I think this is where... And joking, Jesse's back here too. Are they working together? Bruh! Where are we going? <laughs> I don't know if we're supposed to follow them. Whoa! They're like space slides. So joking Jesse, Woolius Julius, and us are going through these slides. We have to hit buttons to maybe go through like a different slide. And if we don't hit the right button, we're going to get oofed. This is so crazy. It's like we're in a different world of Garden of Bam Bam. This looks like a like, like a map that Zolfius would be in. Like Zolfius could just pop out of nowhere. This is like his universe. That's what it reminds me of. Kind of looks like a McDonald's play place with all the different slides. It's like a space playground. Whoa, I'm getting dizzy. So are we like racing them? We have to, like, close some of the slides so that they can't beat us to wherever we're going. It was kind of hard to tell what Woolius Julius was telling us to do. Oh! Yeah, I think we were racing. Are those his kids? It was hard to tell what he said. We, we have to find his kids? He's talking on, like, a space radio, so it's definitely hard to... To tell what he's saying. Is that him? Or is that somebody else? That's his kid, I guess. So Okay, so we're trying to find his kids. I think? I'm so confused. Okay, we, we, we got another one. Oh, yeah. Those have to be foxes. And they're riding on his back? Bro's got a UFO? What? Joking Jesse is literally flying in a UFO. Oh, and he's trying to shoot us. Wait, is this the the mini game? We're getting chased by uh, Joking Jesse in the UFO. He's trying to shoot us down. Maybe we're still racing. Why do these characters always want to race? Oh my gosh! I don't know if we're supposed to be following Woolius Julius. If we're supposed to be beating him in the race. All I know is that Joking Jesse is trying to shoot us with his UFO. So that dude's an alien, apparently, that knows how to control the UFO. And what's with the mushrooms? This is insane. Can't you see Zolfius popping out of here? Like, popping out of the ground? He's like, stop running. No, I'm not going to run, bro. You're shooting lasers at me. We got uh, mushrooms with tentacles. And you're flying a UFO. I'm just a human. He keeps trying to shoot those big shelves. Is he trying to, like... Oof us? So maybe both of these dudes are evil. I don't know. I kind of want Wooly as Julius to be on our side. I feel like him and his his wolf kids, they could probably be a, of a big help to us. Because we still haven't figured out who attacked Coach Piccolina's kids. Did we? Unless it was Joking Jesse. It probably was, because he ran away, and now he's, he's trying to run us over with his UFO. 
Bro, it ends like that? No! I really thought that the mini game was cool with the, the planets and everything and then how we, we had to go through those like space slides. And it must have been Woolius Julius who turned off the lights to let Joking Jesse escape. But do we really know who attacked Coach Piccolina's kids or is it just going to be a mystery forever? I'm pretty sure that it was Joking Jesse because he seems like he might be Woolius Julius' sidekick. But it's kind of hard to tell. Guys, go make sure to subscribe to Buggy Huggy if you haven't already. And if you guys enjoyed this and want to see more, hit that like button. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you all in the next one. Peace!